Hello everyone, welcome to solve this nice math Olympiad algebra problem. So here we have t minus 9 is equals to t and we solve this problem for the values of t. So if uh, in your exams the question is that uh, find the value of t. So in order to find the value of t uh, then you can do uh, this method but if in your exam uh, question is that you just verify that is this equation has a solution or not then you can just uh, write by inspection of uh, this solution okay so here uh, i cannot uh, do the inspection of this uh, question here i can first find the value of t and then uh, we check or we verify this value of t i hope so you understand this question and you understand this method uh, so if you have any other method in your mind so please don't hesitate to write this method into the comment section so please write this method in which you can find the value of t first so that uh, in this method first we need to take the squaring on both of the sides so when we take squaring it will be written as t minus 9 whole square is equals to t square and here we use the algebraic formula you know about that if we have a minus b whole square is equals to a square minus 2 times of a b plus b square so uh, according to this uh, algebraic formula we can expand the left hand side of the above equation as because here our a is equals to t and b is equals to 9 according to this formula we write the above equation as t square minus 2 times of a is t and b is 9 plus b square so b is 9 square is equals to t square so now further in the next step we need more simplifications and it will be written as t square minus this is 2 times of 9 is equals to 18 times of t plus this 9 square equals to 81 and we move this plus t square in the left hand side and it will be written as minus t square and this whole equation equals to 0. And here we need to add or subtract the like terms as you see here this is negative term and this is positive term are gone and we will get here minus 18t plus 81 is equals to 0. So now further in the next step. Uh, here because we first find the value of t for this uh, we move uh, minus 18 t to the right hand side and it will be written as 81 is equals to 18 t so in order to find the value of t we need to remove this 18 from right hand side for this we divide both of the sides by 18 so when you divide both of the sides by 18 it will be written as uh, this is 81 divided by 18 is equals to 18 t is divided by 18 so so in the next step here we need to cancel uh, these terms and uh, we will cancel these terms by the table of 9 and you get here 9 9 is 81 and 9 2 is 18 so we get here 9 divided by 2 is equals to this 18 is cancelled out by this 18 and we get here our t so this is the our final value of t in this problem uh, and now uh, here we find the value of t in the next step we need to verify this value of t so for verification of the value of t we need to copy down given question statement here and it is t minus 9 is equals to t this is our question statement and now we substitute the value of t on both of the sides and we check that is both of the sides are equal or not so uh, here you have this is t and t is equals to 9 over 2 minus 9 is equals to 9 over 2 here we check that is both of the sides are equal or not uh, so that we need to uh, take the LCM of the left hand side and its LCM is 2 and we get here this is 9 minus 2 times of 9 is 18 and we check that is this equals to 9 over 2. So uh, here we have 9 minus 18 is equals to minus 9 divided by 2 uh, 
uh, and we check that is this equals to 9 over 2 or not and you clearly say that minus 9 over 2 is not equals to 9 over 2 so uh, this is not possible uh, here uh, this is not possible it means that the value of t equals 9 over 2 is not satisfied over a given question statement uh, so uh, finally uh, we conclude that the given equation has no solution okay so this is the, our final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos